This is David from Tech Stuff at Voice Plus, and today we'll be tethering the HTC Desire to the laptop via Bluetooth, which basically means you'll be able to wirelessly connect your computer to the internet. First thing you'll need to do is install a program called PDA Net. If you just go to the marketplace and do a search, For PDA Net, and as you can see, we've got a PDA Net free edition. We just click on that and we install it. It'll just take a minute or so to download. Now it's downloaded, all we do is start it. Now basically what this will do is when I pair this to the laptop it'll see it as a Bluetooth mode opposed to just being a phone. So we just hit PDA Net and we'll enable Bluetooth done which means dial up networking. Just give it permissions. Okay. Now that side of it's done. Now what we need to do we need to pair the uh, laptop to the phone. Now if it's already paired, we're going to have to uh, pair it again. So I'll actually just remove it, because at the moment it's only paired as a phone. I need to repair it as a, um, as a modem. So I've just removed it. I'll just click Add. And it'll just take us through the wizard again. And there's my HTC Desire. I'll just hit next. We'll just choose a pass key here, which is just the password. Uh, we can put anything in here. I'll just put one, two, three, four. And hit next. Now if you go to the phone now, you can go to menu and notifications. You'll see a pairing request between the computer and the phone. So I'll just tap on that and it'll ask me for the password. I'll just put in one, two, three, four, and click OK. And there you go, and you'll see with uh, XP, we'll actually start installing a, um, the drivers for the Bluetooth modem. Then we hit finish. Now the, phone, the computer is now paired to the uh, phone and it's seeing it as a modem. Now to actually get the device talking to each other, what we're going to have to do is create a uh, network connection. So what we'll do, we'll just go to right click on my network places and go to properties. Then up here we'll just click on create new connection. And a wizard will start. And we'll just go next. Now we'll be connecting to the internet, so we'll leave that ticked. We'll want to set the connection up manually. So we'll tick that. We'll connect using dial up modem to get in. So we'll go next, and you'll be able to see your Bluetooth. Modem over uh, standard modem over a Bluetooth link, which is what we want to tick. Untick everything else and hit next. ISP name. Now, this is just the name of the uh, connection we're making, so I'll just put HTC Desire. The phone number. This phone number will be universal, it's just a matter of actually dialing into the phone itself. It'll be star 99 hash. For anybody's use, password is all password and username is all left blank, and I won't make this the default internet connection. And we'll just add a shortcut to the uh, desktop for future reference. Now 
Okay, and now you can see it's brought up the uh, dial-up window to connect to the HTC. And if I hit dial and I've done everything correctly, it should open port, dial in. And now if I go to the internet, and I'll select a web page, we'll go to one of our suppliers. And there you go, the web page loads and there's no wires between the computer and the telephone. This is David from Tech Stuff at Voice Plus.